Hey guys, wanted to share my thoughts on this um, Marmot rifle sling here. Uh, this is the box, it's an Amazon purchase. Um, quick story about this is there's actually a fellow YouTuber who uh, gave my information to this Marmot company and they reached out to me then and said, hey, would you do a review for a product? And I didn't know that this is what they were actually sending. Um, but I had said, yes, you know, I, I'd be willing to do it. And um, so there's actually already a couple short brief reviews on this by other channels, but um, I have a few other things to say about it. But so reading just uh, off their box here real quick, it is adjustable from 39 to 46 inches. Um, it does have some leather. It's got leather around up and through here, down through here. It's a nylon on one side and leather on the other side. Um, it's supposed to be sweat proof and rain proof. Um, and it does have some pretty nice um, metal clips um, over here that you know will attach to your swivels. So it's nice having the clips already on the sling. Um, some things that I like about it, this gel padding that's back here is really soft and, and it grips really well. And I also like the width of it. Fits over your shoulder pretty good. A lot of slings are just that nylon right through there. And that's what it goes over top of you. So the pad does make it nice. However, the pad is stitched into the nylon here and a pad is not adjustable so where whatever wherever it is whenever you put it that's that's how it has to stay i would like maybe to have a feature to where this could actually like this could slide down the whole the whole thing here could move so much um because then once it's on your shoulder the pressure of that should make it stay in place i do really like this padding though i mean it, it really is soft the stitching on it is like really done nicely um, all the way around. The stitching through here, the stitching through here, it's, it's well made for sure. Um, and, and you know, it has an adjustment for length down here and I have it right now open up basically to the, to the biggest spot that it can go. Um, so you can adjust that, which will obviously shorten or lengthen the entire thing, but it still doesn't change the location of the pad. And that's important here in a minute. I'll show you something. Uh, the Basically, it, it's set up right now for a two-point sling. So obviously, you can see I have it attached there, and I have it attached there, uh, which is the way most people, I, I think that's probably the most common way that people will wear them. And, you know, that's kind of set up for just over the shoulder, uh, muzzle up. That's probably a common way that a, a lot of guys getting out of your truck going to the fields or going to the woods that's just the way that you would carry it you can also set this up to where it would be muzzle down Let me get that off the screen there so muzzle down two point uh, the difference is there you would want to switch the soft point to the back of the sling so you can do it that way if you want uh, if you're going to do more of a longer walk uh, you may want to go with like a crossbody, put it on top of one shoulder, wrap it around your front, and then come under the opposite arm. Um, and then you'd want to have the the soft part. You'd want to have that on your left side, then so it's going to go closer towards your muzzle. And then this way here is a crossbody with muzzle down. And if this is the way that you're going to carry it, then I would put your soft part. Uh, toward the butt of the gun then but there's a lot of different ways that you can carry it and then so again it's set up for two point right now you can see it's attached to my swivels front and rear but a lot of guys like to run just a single point and that is one nice thing about this type of sling is you can basically just detach it and it has the quick connect disconnect levers here and they're actually pretty pretty solid and if you want to you can just take that and come over here with it and now you have a single point that you can run again most people would be like crossbody with this here um, and this would be so that you have if, if you need to do a quick shot basically 
uh, it's for carrying, but it's also so that you actually still have the gun in your hands and you can quickly bring the muzzle up and, and do a shot that way. Another little thing, and, and personally, I don't, I think it's kind of gimmicky, but it does have these two uh, spots right here that you can put two rifle rounds in here. I think they call them like emergency rounds or something, but I don't know if I would ever, ever use that. And my first thoughts were, boy, this is, you know, almost too pretty to like throw in the back of a truck, you know, like the bed of a truck or to lay it out in a tree stand or, uh, but they claim that it is, like I said, weatherproof and um, I haven't actually tried that to, to prove that. Overall though, it, it does have really nice quality parts and I, and I really like the, the clips on it, the, uh, the quick disconnects and uh, the leather seems pretty good. The stitching is great. Um, I do have two complaints. Number one is the pricing. And I am going to send this video to Marmot and I think that they are overpriced by quite a bit. And right now on Amazon they are $35.99. And you can get quality slings from Allen and, and whoever, but for in the $20 to $25 range. And they're well-known names that have been around for a long time. So I think starting off at $36, I personally think it's high. Um, so I'd like to see them maybe try to bring that down to the $25 range or so. And then my second complaint are that the hooks don't swivel. So it would be nice if right here, if there were a swivel and you could still have it still have the loop connect let me show you here let me pull this off so still have this connect to the sling itself but put a swivel right there that way this thing could actually turn while it's on the sling because um, right now it's not uncomfortable to wear by any means but it would be better if this could could rotate on top of this so that's just an idea for you so, but yeah, I will leave the uh, Amazon link for them. Uh, it is quality. I mean, it, it's a really, really nice sling. It's probably the nicest sling that I have. So, uh, but I, I think that they're just a little bit high. And I think if they come down, it's going to be a, a great option for guys. Again, it's the Marmot 2. And that's kind of what you'll search for on uh, Amazon. But I will leave the link for them, okay? All right, guys. Thanks for watching. I appreciate it.